Congratulations on getting your own AirHog Supernova! Here's a quick guide on how to master the basics. Grab the AirHog Supernova from the top of the protective cage or on the sides. Rotate it 180 degrees so the LED core is facing the ground. Now you're looking at the bottom of the device. Flip the switch to the ON position. After turning the device on, make sure you've got a full battery charge and the LED core is green. That means it's ready to launch. And remember, the AirHog Supernova is designed for indoor play. Find a clear space without any tables, chairs, or obstacles so you can have the best flying experience. To launch, grab the AirHog Supernova from the top of the cage or hold it by its sides and gently toss it into the air. The rotors will automatically activate. Once you toss it and the propellers activate, give it a few seconds to stabilize. The AirHog Supernova will bob up and down as it gets used to its environment and it should hover around hip distance from the floor. Once it stabilizes and the LED light is white, it's ready for you to start giving it inputs to play. You can move the AirHog Supernova upward if you put your hand below the device and move it up, or you can lower your hand to move it downwards. You can also move it side to side if you put a hand or body part in front of one of the four sensors, highlighted by red chrome. As you put your hand in front of any of the sensors, it will move in the opposite direction. For best results, start giving the AirHog Supernova inputs when it is hovering stably in front of you, about a foot away from your body. The product responds best to slow, steady commands so that the sensors can understand your movement. Again, you don't need to actually touch the AirHog Supernova. The motion sensors will do all of the work for you. If the AirHog Supernova starts to drift, you can easily trim, also known as stabilizing or calming it, by using small swipes. Keep trimming until it stably hovers in the air. To stop the AirHog Supernova and turn the propellers off at any time, all you need to do is flip it over so the LED light faces the floor. Remember, grab or catch the device from the top of the cage or from the outsides with flat palms so you don't stick your fingers in the device. Once upside down, the rotor should come to a complete stop. You can give it a toss again to restart the propellers and keep playing, or you can switch it off. We recommend charging again when you're finished playing because the AirHog Supernova works best on a full charge. Once you've mastered the basics, you're ready to move on to Super Tricks. Check out our video on Super Tricks to learn how to pull off these awesome moves.